Hey guys, welcome back to my channel for today's Tutorial Tuesday. I'm going to be following along to Charlotte Tilbury's Feline Flick Eye, which is kind of her like signature thing that she does. I think I discovered Charlotte Tilbury kind of through Lisa Elridge, and then I've subscribed to her and kind of followed her looks. Usually on her channel she posts super wearable looks, and she's also selling her own cosmetics line, so they do come off a little bit like addy or advertising. Like every product she uses is like the best product ever. But um, that being said, you can still learn a lot from these ladies. And this is again, just one of those signature looks. It reminds me a lot of the 90s and it's supposed to elongate and lift your eye and maybe also make your eye look a little bit smaller. So we'll see how that goes with glasses. So let's get started. So the very first step she does is to curl the eyelashes. So I'm gonna curl, curl both of my lashes here. The next step she does is to take her just eyeliner pencil. I'm going to be attempting this with my trusty It Cosmetics No Tug Waterproof Gel Eyeliner. She uses just a regular pencil from her line and she does say it does need to be sharp. I don't have like an actual pencil pencil for whatever reason right now, but you can go in and sharpen these gel liners with the sharpener on the end of the pencil. So we'll see how this goes here. Anyway, she starts just in the inner corner of her eye. Next, we're going to draw a line along our lash line really close, about three quarters of the way to the outside edge of our eye. Once we get three quarters of the way, she stops and makes a point where she wants the line to end up and then just kind of follows that line with her pencil. I find this much easier to do with liquid. Her advice for if and when you make a mistake, dip a cotton bud in some heavy moisturizer and then you can just wipe away any mistakes. Line the waterline. as well as join up the tail of our wing to the lower lash line. At this point she says you can go in and reshape the eye any way you like and just go over the lines and just kind of sharpen everything up and get everything looking exactly how I want. Then she takes the pencil and goes along the lower lash line. She then takes a detail brush and just quickly and sort of blends that in. Once you're done with that, you can move on to mascara. So we're going to apply a ton of mascara to our top lashes. She says when you're applying your mascara, try to drag the lashes outwards, kind of towards the flick that we made to help elongate that eye. She moves on to add some highlighter to the cheeks and temples just to add some what she calls architecture to the face. She goes on to line her lips using a lip pencil and a lipstick, just a nudie lipstick. I'm going to cheat and use my Benefit Their Real Lipstick in Musty Rose. If you want this look to last all day, maybe go over it with a gel liner or I'm going to fill in the rest of the shape just using my liquid liner. Then she throws on a pair of falsies. Normally I would say whatever look you're doing, it's okay to skip falsies if you're not comfortable wearing them. But since this look kind of encloses up our eyes, using lashes will definitely help look our line look a little bit better overall. And it'll make our eyes look a lot bigger. Alright, and that concludes the look. So hope you enjoyed that today. It's a very sexy, I actually don't think it looks terrible with glasses, especially with this like clear frame thing we have going on. So I hope you guys enjoyed that today. If you have any questions, concerns, or comments, let me know in the comments down below. If you did enjoy today's video, give me a huge thumbs up and subscribe down below to see more new daily videos from me. If you did enjoy today's video, do share it with any friends who might find it helpful. And you can also check me out over on Patreon if you want to help support my channel further.
Aside from that, guys, I will see you all tomorrow in my next beauty video. Bye.